All right. Welcome. Uh, my name is Gabriel. You guys can call me Gabe. Uh, today we are going to be doing a squad workout. Uh, I have my assistant, my help. His name is Dre. He's going to be doing all the demonstrations. I'm going to be doing all the talking. Uh, so I hope you guys like the sound of my voice because you guys are going to be hearing it a lot throughout this hour. <laughs> so it's squads. Uh, we're going to start with a little bit of a warm up. Uh, we're going to do some strength-based exercises. Then we're going to finish off with some conditioning. Cool. We're just going to wait a couple of seconds uh, so everyone can join. Uh, Dre is looking like he's getting ready for the warm-up, and then we can get going. Cool. Dre, you ready for this? Yeah, let's do it. All right. Again, people on Instagram, if you want to get a little bit more coaching, you can join us on Zoom. Follow us through uh, the link on our Instagram page, and you can do that through there. All right, so we're gonna start the warm up. Trey, you ready to get warmed up? Yeah, let's do it, my man. All right, so warm up, we are gonna start with some reaching squats. So reaching squats for 30 seconds, pushing your hips back, bending our knees, uh, just reaching your arms out like that. And we are gonna do this for 30 seconds, and I got the timer starting now. Jody, welcome, welcome. How's it going? Good, good. Vass on Instagram, hopefully you're warming up. Everyone else on Zoom, you guys looking good. We got 10 seconds left here. <clears throat> and time. All right, our next warm up exercise is gonna be a lateral lunge so we can have our feet super wide. We're gonna push our hips back and bend our knees. And we can start now. Just going through that full range of motion, making sure our hip, knee, and foot is in that straight line. You can see Dre is keeping that other leg straight uh, compared to the one that he is bending. Nice, looking good, Dre. Uh, I'm gonna play some, just some small music now. I'll put the warm up. And we got five seconds left at this spot. Jugu, thanks for joining. All right, and time. Next, we're gonna get into our good morning. So good morning, we're gonna have soft knee bend. We're gonna keep our spine nice and neutral, and we're gonna push our hips back, get that small stretch in our hamstring, and then stand back up. We're gonna be doing that for 30 seconds, just moving through that full range of motion. There you go, keeping your chest up, and getting that stretch in the back of your leg. Nice. As you can see, uh, Dre has his hands on his hips, you can put it on your on your head, on your hips, uh, whatever you're feeling. And we got five seconds left. And time. All right, next we're gonna get into our yoga push-ups. So we're gonna be in a push-up position. From here, we are gonna push our hips back and bring our head between our arms. And you're gonna get that stretch in the hamstrings and a little bit in your lats as well. So we can start that now. We're gonna do 30 seconds of these. Remember on Zoom, uh, if you feel comfortable with turning on your camera, it's gonna give me a better opportunity to coach you guys up uh, and join our fun party that we got with squads today. We want Instagram, hope you guys are joining in. We're just finishing up the warm up. And then we're going to get into the actual workout. Nice. We got five seconds left at this position. And time. All right. Now we are going to do a little bit of a pull pattern. So if you got a towel um, or a blanket, whatever you have, you can put it on the ground, put it around your foot. And we're gonna get into 10 second ISO holds. So from here, grabbing one side of the towel, you're going to bring your elbow up and squeeze your shoulder blades together. And we're gonna hold that for 10 seconds. Ready when you are, Gabe. And we can go. So squeeze. And relax. We're going to do Same the time. other side now. Okay. All right, other side, going in three, two, one, and pull. All 
and relax. Very good. Ooh. All right, we are going to explain the workout, and then we're going to get into the actual workout. All right, Dre, you feeling ready and warm? Yeah, I'm ready. All right, so really for warm. today, we are going to be doing something called EMOM, uh, but we're going to be doing it 45 seconds. So every exercise, you have 45 seconds to complete 12 reps. Whatever is left over in time is going to be your rest time. So first exercise, we got a couple of options. The first option is going to be a kettlebell swing. So Dre is going to get a weight or a kettlebell, height, height the weight back, and just extend at the hips coming through. If you do not have a kettlebell, you don't feel comfortable with this movement, we are going to get into an RDL. So kind of the same thing as the good morning mornings. We are going to have a soft knee bend, pushing our hips back, keeping our spine neutral, and then standing up. So you can use whatever weight you guys have at home. Dre's using um, – Books, you can use a backpack, you can use uh, whatever you have at home. <laughs> Second exercise is going to be our squat. So just the same thing as a warm-up, getting a weight, you can use a backpack, whatever you need, pushing your hips back, banging our knees, and going to that full range of motion. We're gonna get 12 of those. <laughs> Last exercise for this complex is going to be push-ups. Uh, with the push-ups, making sure our shoulders away from our ears, we're getting that full range of motion. So coming down to our chest to the ground, coming back up. If that is too difficult, we can push our feet wide, and we're going to just get shoulder taps. The apps are going to be 12 aside. <clears throat> cool. Uh, Vass, you had a question. Can you, can you do swing with dumbbells or better do RDLs? I would recommend just sticking with the RDLs if you only have dumbbells. Cool. All right. Zoom, are we ready to go? Yeah. Instagram, you guys ready to go? We are going to give you guys 10 seconds before we start. So remember, 12 reps of everything. First exercise is going to be the RDLs or swings. We're going to start in 10 seconds. I'm going to pump up the music. We're going to go in two, one. And let's go. We're going to get those swings or RDLs. With the swings or RDLs, making sure our spine is staying neutral. We have a soft knee bend. And we're going to go 12 reps of these. Looking good. As you notice, Dre is keeping his spine nice and neutral. Looking very good. So after those 12 reps, take a break. And we have... 15 seconds before we got to start the squats. We're going to go in five seconds. We're going to start with the squats. So get whatever weight you have, and away we go. So keeping our chest nice and tall, pushing our hips back, keeping our hip, knee, and foot in a straight line. And a big one with these squats, making sure that the center of pressure is the center of our foot. We don't want to be on our toes. We don't want to be on our heels. Making sure we're keeping that nice and good. Jody, back with the yellow weights. I love it. Looking good. And don't forget to breathe. As you can hear, Dre's breathing. He's doing a good job. So we're going to get 12 of those. And then we got 10 seconds. But we got to get into our push-ups or shoulder taps. We're going to go in, two, one, and away we go. Getting our push-ups, that full range of motion. We get the taps and the push-ups are too much. This again, keeping our shoulders away from our ears. Getting that full range of motion. Great, looking good. If this gets too difficult, we can go on our knees. Uh, if you want to make it harder, you can put your hands on something. Looking good. So we got 15 seconds left of this. Uh, and then we are going to go back to the top. And we're going to get into our RDLs or swings. So that's round one done. And we're going to get four rounds in total. So we're going to go in two, one. And let's go back to the RDLs or swings. And we're keeping our shoulder blades tucked together, chest tall. Dre is doing a good job with these RDLs. You should be feeling a little bit of a stretch in the back of your legs. 
Everyone's looking good. Instagram, hopefully you guys are joining us, keeping up with the workout. Keep on Zoom. We got Jody killing it. I don't know about everyone else, but hopefully you guys are having a good workout. Just repositioning my camera here so I can get my water bottle. All right, so we got 10 uh -huh. seconds, and then we're going to get into the squats again. Remember, we're going for 12 reps of everything. We're going to go in two, one. Here we go. Your squats can be bodyweight squat. You can use weights. You can use your backpacks. Um, and then with side view, Dre right here, making sure we're keeping that spine nice and neutral. Uh, we don't want to go so low that we start rounding our hips underneath. Uh, yeah, so just go through that range that you're comfortable with. And we got 20 seconds left to get into our, our 12 reps. Everyone's looking good though. Instagram, keep it going. Okay, how many rounds we got total? We got four rounds and we're gonna go in three seconds. We're gonna start our uh, push-ups. All right, so we can start with our push-ups. We're gonna go at 12 push-ups. Looking good. Making sure we get that full range of motion with the push-ups. Let's see if we can get our chest nice and close to the ground. Everyone's looking good. Shoulders away from our ears. And this is, we are just finishing up our second round. If you guys are just joining us. We're going to do two more rounds. Trey, how's it going? I'm good. Talk. Doing good? Talk you need a me. break? No, I'm good. All right. Because we are going to go again in five seconds. Five seconds, we're going to go back to our RDLs or um, cam RDLs or swings, so we can get that going right away. Nice. Top knee bend, pushing our hips back, keeping our chest nice and tall. Looking good. Dre sticking with the swings. You guys can stick with the RDLs, keeping our chest nice and tall. So everyone's looking good. Nice, Jody. Killing that shoulder blades back, chest and tall. Looking good, everyone. All right, we got 15 seconds, and then we're going to start with our squats. <clears throat> so 10 seconds, catch your breath. Three, two, one, and away we go. Pushing our hips back, bending our knees at the same time. Vast, you're feeling it, eh? <laughs> Keeping our chest nice and tall, and we're going to get 12 reps of these in our 45 seconds. Everyone's looking good. It's tall. Hip, knee, and foot in a straight line, making sure we're feeling that pressure in the center of our foot. We're not going too back on our heels, but too forward on our toes. Nice, everyone's looking good. We still got a couple of seconds, but our next exercise is going to be our push-ups. Uh, if the push-ups on our feet are getting too difficult, we can go on our knees, uh, we can do our shoulder taps, whatever you guys are feeling for today. So we got 15 seconds. And then we're going to get into it. Trey, how are we feeling? I feel great. You're good. All right. We got five seconds. <laughs> then we're going to get into our push-ups. So, two, one. Here we go. If we're doing the taps, make sure our feet are super wide and our hips are not moving all over the place. We want to keep it nice and stable. Push-ups. Just going through your full range of motion. Trying to get your chest as close to the ground. Keeping our shoulders away from our ears and getting that nice uh, chest pump on this Thursday afternoon. So we still got a couple of seconds before we start our last round. Uh, catch your breath. Get your mind ready. Get everything set. <laughs> and strong. Uh, so we've got... 17 seconds before we start back to the top for our last round with our RDLs. We got 10 seconds and we're going to start with our RDLs. 
or kettlebell swings. What are you feeling? We're going in three, two, one, and away we go. So the biggest thing with this one, we want to make sure our spine is staying neutral, um, keeping our chest tall, and just having that small knee bend. All the movement should be coming from our hips, pushing your glutes back, uh, keeping our chest nice and tall. Looking good, Jody. Looking good. See if we can get a little bit lower. Dre is killing it. Instagram, hope you guys are enjoying the music, enjoying the workout. Uh, this is our last round for this complex. And then we're going to talk a little bit about the next complex. It's snowing outside. It's not snowing? It is snowing. What's happening? That's not good. <laughs> All right, we got 15 seconds, and then we're going to get into our squats. Jody, you're doing a good job. Keep it up. We got five seconds, and we're going to do our squats. All right, here we go. Transitioning to those squats, pushing our hips back uh, like we're sitting on a chair, keeping our hip, knee, and foot in a straight line. Looking good. Keeping our chest tall. You see Dre's going down to his range of motion. Everyone's range of motion is going to be a little bit different. Just uh, depending on your mobility or experience with your squats. Good. Remember, we're getting 12 of these here. We've got a couple of seconds left in our 45 seconds. Jody's looking good. Chest tall. Nice and low. Mm. All right, we got 15 seconds, and we're going to get into the last round of push ups or shoulder taps, uh, whatever you guys are feeling. So we're going to go in three, two, one, and away we go. Remember, keeping our shoulders away from our ears. Um, if you're doing the push-ups, getting that full range of motion, getting your chest nice and close to the ground, and then popping back up. Ooh. Looking good. Great, that was pretty fast. I'm huh? killing it. Thanks. I did the shoulder taps, challenge myself a little bit more. Yeah, it's been new. Good. April snow brings May glow. I like that. All right, we are just finishing up our shoulder taps and push-ups. We're going to give you a couple of seconds uh, to get your breath, get a drink. Then we're going to explain the last complex. Um, and we're just going to talk about it a little bit. Cool? Dre, how are we feeling? I'm feeling good. Nice and sweaty. Nice, <laughs> nice. Zoom, how are we feeling? Feeling good? All right. Yeah, Instagram, that's feeling? good. Give some love for Dre for working hard today. Yeah, give me some love. Come on, fire me up, people. Let's go. All right. So our next complex is going to be the same concept with every minute on the minute. So we are, this time we're going to have a minute um, to do eight reps of three different exercises. <clears throat> so the first exercise that we got is going to be a lateral lunge. So you can hold the weight uh, if you want. If not, you can just do body weight. So we're gonna have our feet nice and wide. You're going to push your hips back and bend your knee to one side and then come back up. And then just alternating, just like raise like that, making sure our chest is staying tall. Uh, and yeah, we are gonna get eight aside in the one minute allocator for that. Next exercise is going to be a iso hold lunge with an overhead press. <clears throat> so you're gonna sink down into that lunge position and then you're gonna be pressing above head just like that. You're gonna keep your core nice and tight, making sure your shoulder is away from your ear. So we're gonna get eight presses on one side and then you're gonna switch legs and gonna do eight on the other side. So the last exercise that we've got is going to be a soup. head bug. Um, with the presses, you can use a can, water bottle, whatever weight you guys have around the house. Uh, last one is going to be a dead bug. So we're going to be in on our back. We're going to keep our core nice and tight, belly button drawn into the floor. And you're going to reach out with opposite leg and opposite arm while maintaining that spine nice and neutral. If you guys find it's difficult to do opposite leg, opposite arm, you can do the same thing, but one limb at a time. So you can go one arm, one leg out, back, the other leg out, 
and back. So we're gonna get eight of everything. We are gonna give you guys a couple of seconds to get your weight, get a quick drink, stay hydrated, because I'm starting to lose my voice and I need a little bit of water. <laughs> I'm gonna get some water too. <clears throat> All right. We've got three rounds of these, eight reps of everything. Starting off with our lateral lunge. Uh, we are going to start in 15 segundos. <clears throat> so 10 seconds, we're going to start with lateral lunges. I'm going to turn the music on. We can get going. We've got three rounds of these. We're going to get eight reps aside. Two, one. Here we go. First exercise, lateral lunges. Pushing your hips back. Keeping your chest nice and tall. Uh, I feel with this one, the further your legs are, uh, the better. It gives a little bit more room for your hips to go through that full range of motion. Looking good. Dre's killing it. Making sure we're keeping that hip, knee, and foot in a straight line. We don't want our knees to be tracking. I looking good. Jody's looking good. Keeping that chest tall. And then we're just getting eight aside. Instagram, hope you guys are following along. <sighs> so we still have 20 seconds left of this spot uh, or take the rest for the break. And then the next exercise is going to be our ISO hold lunge with an overhead press. So we got 15 seconds of rest left, setting up for the next exercise. Staying nice and low, you're gonna be feeling that burn in those legs and working our arms at the same time. So we're gonna go in three, two, one. Let's go sink down into that lunge, pressing above head. Keeping our core nice and tight. We don't want our ribs to be extending out. We're gonna keep our ribs nice and tucked in. Dre is doing a good job with that. The lower you go, the harder it's gonna be. Uh, just counting out eight from here, and then we're going to do the same thing on the other side. So once you do eight on one side, flip over to the other side, and then do eight on again on the other side. Uh, with all our pushing patterns, we want to make sure that our shoulders are away from our ears. We don't want our shoulders to be creeping up, so keep that shoulder down, keep that shoulder down, or pressing above head. And that is a big feature that we have uh, with all our pushing, so push and everything. So we're just finishing up uh, this last exercise. Still got 20 seconds to go, and then we're gonna get into our dead bug position. So we got 15 seconds, we're gonna do a dead bug. Dead bug is a little bit more of a core work. Uh, and just focus a little bit on Dre because this one is a little bit of a trick exercise. We're gonna go in five seconds. Two, one. All right, we're gonna have both limbs up, keep our core tight, opposite leg and opposite arm is reaching out, or we can go one limb at a time. So Jody, you can go one leg at a time. So go right leg, yeah, back, left leg, back, there you go, and then one arm at a time. Yes, there you go, just like that. There you go, keeping that core nice and tight. Uh, this is not a race, uh, just getting eight aside. Dre is keeping everything nice and stable. Uh, he's pushing his back into the ground and keeping that core nice and tight and making sure we are not extending our ribs when we are reaching out. Very good. This is the last spot for this round. And then we're going to go back to the lateral Ooh. lunges at the end of this. Dre, how you doing? I'm good, man. I'm good. All right. Those are we're good. Like 20 those seconds bugs. left. And then we're gonna right. go back to the top and get into our lateral lunges. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> Instagram, hope you guys are joining us. If you guys want a little bit more coaching, join us on Zoom and we can coach you up. All right, we got two, one. Here we go, lateral lunges. So Drake got the side view. Uh, the same thing as the squats. We wanna keep that spine nice and neutral. Uh, and just go at your own pace, in your own range of motion, keeping that spine neutral. We don't want our butt tuck underneath to get that butt in. <laughs> the blades back, chest tall. Jody's looking good, keeping that chest up. Sinking our hips back and bending our knee at the same time while keeping that other leg straight. Everyone's doing a good job here. 
Dre, you got textbook technique. I love it. Have you done this oh, before? Thank you. Yeah, you know, when I had great coaches like yourself coaching me up, I can really <laughs> work on my form, you know? I try. Do my best. <laughs> All right, we've got 20 seconds left of rest, and then we're gonna get into our ISO lunge overhead press. Jay, do you feel it more in your legs or your arm this, this next exercise? More in my legs, for sure. More in your legs? All right, fair enough. ISO hold, yeah, for sure. But I'm gonna try with heavier weight to see if that works. All right, we're gonna go in three, two, one, and let's go. Sink it down to that lunge and press it overhead. Uh, another coaching this one. Making sure when we press, we're not leaning over. We're keeping our core nice and tight, and everything is in a straight line. So Dre is doing a good job of that, keeping it nice and tight. <clears throat> See, we can challenge this by getting a little bit lower in our lunge. I know our legs are getting a little bit sore, but see if we can challenge ourselves a little bit more. Now we're just getting eight aside, keeping that chest tall. Sinking down into that lunge. Uh, and a big thing with this one, making sure our hip, knee, and foot is a straight line. I've been saying that quite often. Uh, it's just one of our main uh, coaching cues that we use here. Yeah, keeping that core nice and tight. All the way from our ears. Okay, we're killing it. That was good. That was better. That was better. It looked better. A challenge. All right, we still got 20 seconds left. So we can get ready for our dead bug position. Remember with this one, keeping our core nice and tight. We can get opposite arm, opposite leg, or you can do one limb at a time, just depending on how you're feeling today. So we're gonna go in five, three, two, one, and away we go. Belly button drawn to the ground, core tight. Opposite leg, opposite arm. Chody, looking good. Keep that core nice and tight. And don't forget to breathe through this one. Good. One on Zoom. Looking good. I hope you guys are still following us. Keep your core nice and tight. Extending out. You want to extend out so much that your back comes off the ground. It's the same thing. Everyone just go through your own range of motion, own speed, own pace. We're doing a great job. All right, we got 20 segundos, and we're going to start our last set. Starting off with those lateral lunges. Almost there, guys. The last set of the day. Going in 10 seconds. So stand up, feet nice and wide, pulling our weight, getting ready for it. We're going to go in three, two, one, and away we go. Pushing our hips back, tending our knees, making sure our hip, knee, and foot in a straight line, giving our chest nice and tall. Looking good. Jody, killing it on Zoom. I'm loving it. Everyone else on Instagram, hope you guys are enjoying it. Callie says hi. What's up, Callie? Dre's looking good. <laughs> We're gonna get eight aside here. Looking good. Nice, nice. Going through the full range of motion. Still got 20 seconds left for this one. And then we're gonna start with our ISO lunge overhead press. All right, we're going to go in 10 seconds for this ISO lunge overhead press. See if we can sink a little bit lower. It's the last time through, so challenge ourselves. All right, here we go. Low lunge position, pressing above head, keeping our core nice and tight. Make sure we're not extending through the ribs, keeping our core nice and tight. This is a full body exercise, uh, challenging a lot different things. Challenge the balance, our back control, shoulder control, and knee control at the same time. Everyone's looking good. Slow it down if you need to, if things are not under control. Almost there, guys. Last set, and we are going to. Nice. Keeping those shoulders away from our ears. Everyone on Zoom is doing a good job. Instagram, keep going. We're almost there. 
Nice, Trey. How you feeling? I'm dead. Those are hard. <laughs> oh, boy. Right, we got 15 seconds, and we're going to get into our last exercise of the day for this squad session. We're going to go in five seconds. Three, two, one. And here we go. Core tight, opposite leg, opposite arm, or you can stick with the single limb. Whatever you guys are feeling today. Looking good. Jody, if these are getting too easy, you can reach out a little bit further with your legs. It's like, yeah, there you go. Nice. Looking good. Core tight. Don't forget to breathe. Keep breathing through your nose and your mouth. Almost there. Just eight aside. Grace, killing it. Techniques always good, like always. In the textbook or something. All right. Very good, everyone. We are going to catch a breath, get a little bit of a drink, and then we are going to get into a cool down stretch stretch session. Trey, how you feeling? How was it? I'm feeling good, man. I'm feeling good. Thanks for that workout, my man. That was unreal. That's good, that's good. All right, get a quick drink, catch your breath, let our heart rate come down a little bit, and then we are going to get to the stretching. All right. Woo, my guy. That was a good workout, Dre. Quad burner, man, quad burner. Definitely a quad burner. All right, <laughs> um, we can start with our hip flexor stretch. So we're gonna down on one knee, other leg is going to come up. It's like this. We're going to squeeze that glute uh, on the opposite leg. So that right leg that is down. Uh, if you need a little bit more of a stretch, you can lift that leg up. Dre, you're so dreamy. I, <laughs> I agree with that one. Who said that? <laughs> the mustache. Dre, Dre is going on his mustache. Definitely looking good. Who said I was dreaming? It's a secret. I can't say no. You got to focus <laughs> <laughs> All right, we can get the other legs, the same thing, other leg. Ooh, this is a good one. I've been sitting way too much every day. It's a good stretch to get here. That's how it goes sometimes, Dre. I'm sorry. Yeah, I know, I know. It's good. <laughs> All right, if you're joining us on Instagram and Zoom, uh, just a heads up, we have another session today at 5 p.m. We got a big hit session it's a little bit more high intense um interval training kind of like a boot camp style and that's going to be at 5 p.m with coaches beth and eddie it's definitely a good one so go join if you want join on instagram join on zoom uh zoom is definitely the place to go if you want a little bit more coaching where we can actually see you uh and coach you up all right next we're going to get into our pigeon stretch Bass, you are welcome. So one knee is going to be coming down. The other leg is going to be reaching out. And you're going to feel that stretch in your glute. Uh, try to bring your chest to your knee to get that stretch a little bit more. <clears throat> so yeah, so today, big hit, 5 p.m. with Eddie and Beth. Uh, Dre, when is your next uh, session? Um, I got also a big hit session uh, tomorrow at noon with Coach Rachel. I'll be okay. coaching, giving Rachel a nice, good workout. Nice. So, very nice. Uh, well, yeah, feel free to join. Tomorrow, um, I got a squad session at 5 p.m. with Coach Rachel as well, if you guys want to join. Oh, her. nice. <laughs> I guess Rachel's getting all the workouts on Seal Good Friday. Yeah. <laughs> all right, we can switch legs. <clears throat> I might be uh, coaching. I, I might be doing the workout on uh, oh, there you go. Friday so, or tomorrow. <laughs> Kind of forgetting what days, what weeks, what days we're in. Oh man, I feel that for sure. I feel oh, that. All right, uh, Dre, do you have anything specific you want to stretch? Anything else? Uh, no, I think that's it for me, to be honest. I was, uh, that was a good cool down there. Thank you for the workout, Gabe. I really appreciate it. All right, no problem. Uh, uh, everyone on Instagram, everyone on Zoom, thank you for joining us. Hopefully we can see you guys soon. Um, and best of luck for the rest of your day. See you guys around. 
Dre, super fun. See you around. Have a good yeah, day. Yeah, absolutely, man. Props. Peace. <laughs> Ciao, everyone. Yeah. Oh, yeah?